In this video, we're going to color our self-portraits realistically, meaning that we're going to make them look as much as ourselves as possible. We're going to do this using crayons. I'm going to use a beige for my face, yellow and brown for my hair, green and brown for my eyes because I have hazel eyes, and then a pink for my lips. You should look in the mirror or camera and pick out the colors that best suit you. I'm going to start with my face first. This is the biggest area and is going to allow me to get all the white spaces out. Then I can add detail on top. Try to color in the same direction as this is going to make your picture look a little bit neater. Next, I'm going to color my eyes. My eyes are hazel, which means they're green mixed with brown. What color are your eyes? After I've colored in my eyes, I'm actually going to outline them with brown so that they stand out more. Then I'm going to color in my eyebrows. Make sure you don't forget to also color in your pupils black. I'm also going to outline my different features, like my nose and my freckles, my dimples. Then I'm going to shade in my lips with different color pinks. Now I'm ready to color my hair, and I'm going to start by using the yellow color crayon. I'm going to color in the same direction that my hair grows so I have long hair that's going down. When I'm done with the yellow, my hair is a little bit darker, so I'm going to blend in some brown to make it look more realistic. Now that I'm done with my face, I'm going to add some details. I'm going to add my earrings and my shirt and my necklace. When I'm all done, if I still have time, I can even color the background. That's the empty space around my self-portrait. I can choose one color or several colors to create a design. It's all up to you, boys and girls. Now you are done with your self-portrait and you're ready to post Artsonia. Check out my How to Artsonia video if you have any questions on posting your artwork. 